Okay, I want to show you some uh, some damage, shingle damage uh, caused by uh, the growth of the uh, or the encroachment of trees, tree branches on roofs. Here's a big uh, fruitless mulberry, which is common, a uh, common type of tree that I come across. I'm gonna pull this branch up and take a look underneath. If you look under here, you can see the damaged shingles. Uh, just gonna wear right through it already has actually and uh, cause a leak. So, so a real good idea to keep your trees trimmed back from the roof. If you're buying a house or if you own a house, uh, keep those branches trimmed way back from the roof. They they can uh, damage the uh, roof itself and also they're a, a perfect little highway for rats and mice to climb on your roof, any kind of critters, uh, you know, raccoons, possums. But uh, uh, mostly rats and mice, they'll come right into your attic by way of these trees. You're supposed to keep them about six feet back, I've heard, by pest companies. And then they'll find their way in, in an event into the attic. So you can't keep them out. Once they get on the roof, they can find a way in the attic, but you can keep them off your roof to get to the attic, which is a great idea. So anyway, keep those trees cut back from the roof.